friends, let's film a video of cute outfits even when it's 100 degrees outside. How to look, how to still look cute when it's really hot out. Dressing cute in the summertime. I don't know, somebody requested this video and I said, good idea, let's do it. Let's start with my favorite satin pajama pants. You know, they could use a steaming, but I'm not gonna do that because I'm lazy. When I normally wear these in the summer, I'll pair them with like a baby tee or even like a really oversized baggy tee. You know what it's giving? That coastal grandma on bottom. We're gonna make it a little bit more modern. You guys know this is one of my favorite t-shirts. It's from the brand Awake. Sometimes a big cotton white t-shirt is so good in the blazing heat because if you're one to get burned really bad on your shoulders, it's nice to have them a little bit covered, but it's still super breathable. This is really giving PJs, so we gotta, we gotta spice it up. Normally, for shoes, the way to keep yourself coolest, unfortunately, are sandals. Hate sandals. I just... I just don't think they're very cute. Besides like a kitten heel, but I'm not dressing this up. It could be cute. I never listen to myself. I don't like it. Let's do tennis shoes. Somebody commented in my last video, OMG, you're wearing socks. And look at me, I'm already giving up on socks. I'm just too lazy to put them on and off for a video. I do wear socks. I don't have stinky feet. Okay, this outfit is definitely not gonna be everyone's cup of tea, but I love a big baggy fit. It's so cute to me. Very cute. Let's accessorize. You guys know when I have like a big oversized baggy fit, I like to accessorize with like dainty accessories. So we're gonna add these little vintage Matsuda sunglasses that were actually my dad's like 30 years ago. Marc Jacobs literally sent me this purse and I don't know what I did to deserve it, but prepare to get sick of it because it's so freaking cute. Look at that pop of color and the chain. Like, this purse is so up my alley, so I'm so happy they did send it to me. I've been looking for like a pop of color purse. But see, if I was actually in the heat, I'd put my hair up, so one sec. Because who can wear their hair down when it's like 90 degrees? Also, I'm from Michigan, so it never gets like 100 here. The hottest it probably gets is like 95, 96. So maybe I'm not one to talk about this topic. 96 is still hot. And there it is, a very modest, hot day, hot girl outfit. Literally, if you came and felt these pants, like they are so thin, the wind goes right through them. I can't bring them out until it's like 80 degrees outside because it's like freezing. Oh my God, I love this purse. It is so cute. Next outfit. We're just showing all my favorite summer looks. This one is definitely made for the heat. This is a thrifted, basically maxi dress and it is like see-through so when it's hot this is my go-to here's the dress you look so put together so cute not like you're just wearing jean shorts and a tank top like this dress is stunning it's one of my favorite dresses of all time and i got it for like 99 cents the brand is the great in the summertime when i don't know what to wear this is always what i'll end up grabbing you can wear it with kid heels if you want to dress it up tennis shoes cowboy boots. If you have a pair of sandals you like, obviously it'll go with it. I just don't like sandals. So let's do cowboy boots. Do those keep you very cool? No. And I am sorry, but these cowboy boots scream summertime to me. I'm always so excited to bring them out. They're thrifted, or they're from eBay, but the brand is Durango. Oh, I love this together. Like, even if you're going to a bar or something at night, this is such a cute outfit and will give you so many compliments. I want a pair of the Marc Jacobs purse again with this. And I just might do it, I'm going to. I don't know if it, it doesn't like really match, but we've just got so many colors going on, it just works. I don't wanna do a black bag because that seems boring. I guess we could do a cream bag. I feel like you guys might say this one looks better. I'm too obsessed with this bag. No, they did not pay me to say any of this stuff. If you give me a present, I will wear it till the end of the earth. Again, if I was wearing this in real life, I'd probably put my hair up. That's fit number two. You guys know I have a thing for wearing pajamas all the time. Literally my first outfit. But this is a little men's PJ set. I thrifted for 25 cents. Um, it gives very much that Matilda Jerf like set vibe, but you get to be unique. And this material is also so thin, so great for the summertime, and it's short sleeve. This outfit is also one of those really good ones where if you just don't like showing off, too much your body but you don't want to be like scorching hot with this i normally just pair it with tennis shoes okay since this outfit's a little bit more like tomboy-y i think a hat like a cap would be cute so of course i'm gonna add my ernie's world one very cute very tomboy this purse feels a little bit like 
too dressy for this outfit, but I like the look of a cream with it. Maybe I just do like a tote bag with this, like, and I don't have one. There's the finished look, outfit number three. I think also, if you have a boyfriend or something, a guy in your life who doesn't know how to dress, um, for a femme and men's pajama set, and it's literally like a built-in outfit, and they'll look so cool. It's for everybody. Okay, this is one of those combos that I think a lot of people just won't get or won't like. Normally, you know, these gingham shorts, I like to pair them with a fancier top. I think it's fun. These are not just boxer shorts. They're um, vintage Nike little gingham shorts. They're amazing. I thrifted them and one of my best finds ever. Normally, I think it's really cute with this Orson Iris Boussier top. But my boobs have recently outgrown it, so I can't wear it. This would also be really cute with this, like, baby doll top. This one's from Revolve. If I can find it, I'll link it down below. It's like a peplum, uh, just like really square neck baby doll top. But this top screams summer because it's literally mesh. Feels like you're not wearing anything. I thrifted it. And this part doesn't look the best, but it's actually just like a cardigan that doesn't clip together. And I just poked two holes and tied this little ribbon. I want to find, or I need to get like a white ribbon or something because it'll look a lot better, but I only had a gingham ribbon, so that's what I used in the meantime to close it off. And I love this look. It is so flattering. So with this, like it might be fun just to dress this up. Mm, I can't tell what I want to do. I think what I've been realizing putting together like summer outfits is that I'm missing a pair of like nude or white or cream kitten heels because I think that would look a lot better with this. So we're gonna do a black bag to try and like even it out. I'm gonna look on Depop or Poshmark literally right after I record this. Like it's just the black that's throwing me off. But I really like these two pieces together. I think it's so fun, so summer appropriate, and would keep you so cool. I love that longer shorts are in now because I don't feel like uncomfortable. And normally I'm not really into high-waisted either, but when I pull these low-waisted, it feels a lot more dressed down. So this is, I think, a super cute outfit. Let me show you another style with pants that I think you can definitely get away with in the summer. So these are the Peachy Den. I think they're called like the Mimi pants. I literally got them in a medium, and then they were too big and I returned them. And by the time I went to go buy a small, they were already sold out. And so then I had a pair from Poshmark that I thrifted and they were just getting a little tight on my uh, thighs. And I don't like the look of them tight on the thighs and just baggy on the calves. I want them baggy all the way up and down. And these do a really good job with that. So let's put these on. So the reason I think these work for the summertime and when it's pretty hot out is because they're so thin, definitely breathable, and they're like, sweat resistant because they're basically like hiking pants and yes I'm gonna keep them with this top because I love the look of it I'm also gonna pair it with my ballet flats I'm literally obsessed with how these all three go together and I know that it's not everybody's favorite and then I'm gonna add a purse we're gonna do this little black fanny pack from Brandy Melville and then I added this Vivian Westwood keychain because I just think it looks cute and there's the next outfit. It really balances out the long pants too, which is having such like a mesh, breathable top. But also like these pants are not hot. They're really thin. Next outfit. Okay, we're going back to like a super basic outfit that I think we all worn in the summertime. Athletic shorts and a big t-shirt. But the way to spice it up now, make it look cool, Sad cowboy boots. <laughs> also, I think having athletic shorts in like a bright color, which I'm sure so many of you guys still have, like those Nike running shorts. I need socks for these. But also, if you don't still have your like running shorts or colorful running shorts, they always have them at the thrift store. And with this, I'd probably carry something easy like a fanny pack. So I love this look. Definitely something I'll be wearing in the summertime a lot. Again, wheel cowboy boots keep you the coolest. No, they'll kind of make your feet sweat. And a lot of your heat comes from like your feet sweating, but I can normally deal with it. And it's just such a fun take on this like super casual outfit. I can't make this video and not talk about my favorite sundress in the entire world. When it is scorching, 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 I don't know. Um, this is the dress I always throw on 
I got it from Depop four or five years ago, but it's originally from Urban, and it's literally my go-to. I wear this dress all the time, and I just love it even more now with cowboy boots. I used to wear it with Doc Martens, I've worn it with sneakers. Another dress or just style of dress that is so good for the summertime. I'd pair it probably with some like shorts or just like nude full coverage underwear. I have full coverage underwear on right now but they're black. I wouldn't do that and just like a nude bra. But these holes throughout the whole dress are so nice and so breathable. Um, this is great as just like a cover up too. But I really like this. It's from Urban and I'm excited to start wearing it. If you can't tell, I just love the cowboy boots. So I've been talking about wanting like a 50s or 60s nightgown and I found one on Poshmark finally for a decent price. It came with matching little shorts and I just love how baby and cute this looks. You might be looking at it and like, when would you ever actually find a time to wear that? I have something very specific in mind, but I can't talk about it yet. But I think it's so cute. I really like it again with the cowboy boots. Daytime drinks or something would be really cute or like if you have a music festival I think this would be like the perfect thing to wear because it is so light and breathable You can move in it and it's comfortable. I am obsessed. You definitely get a lot of looks <laughs> Kind of a tame version of that last look. We have little bloomers with a super short dress This dress was actually like a midi dress from Everlane and I cut it and I cut it a little bit too short Adding some bloomers underneath is my go-to um, and then red cowboy boots just make it a little bit more fun But obviously sneakers sandals whatever goes really well with this you guys just do you get it that I'm too obsessed with cowboy boots Okay, last one with this style I swear but lace and mesh are literally just so appropriate when it's so hot out Here's another dress that I think is just absolutely beautiful. It's from Free People. I've shown this dress paired with cowboy boots before. I think also with tennis shoes would be really cute. My ballet flat. I've shown it with tennis shoes, like running tennis shoes, and it's really cute. But I decided to dress it up and do little kitten heels. And even like this, it's not that dressed up. I think especially if I put my hair up and add some sunglasses, it looks a little bit more casual. You could go like day drinking in this or whatever you want to do, grocery shopping. And sometimes I like to not match my shoes with my purse because I think the pop of color is so fun and just makes this outfit a little less boring. Here's again one of my favorite like sets I always put together. These denim shorts are Tommy Hilfiger but they are thrifted and then this is an Eddie Bauer thrifted denim vest. They go so well together that whenever I'm pairing one I normally have it with the other. I've shown this with cowboy boots, with knee high boots. And with tennis shoes and it also looks very cute with kitten heels this would keep you so cool and i think the pop of color bag is adorable i love this purse okay should i show one more i think that's gonna be it i was gonna show something with this little crochet top that i thrifted got off ebay as you guys could tell anything crochet with holes in it just keeps you so cool and this is like a full open back i normally just wear this as a like cover up though on the beach so I just i'm over it i'm hot and i want to eat something so that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed it make sure to like comment and subscribe if you want to everything will be linked down below that i can find and if it was thrifted i will try to find dupes for you um and if i forget let me know in the comments call me out i love you so much and i'll see you in a few days bye